Okay, is that thing recording yet? Oh, I think it is. <laughs> Hi, welcome back. <laughs> it looks a bit different right now. I actually went through my old stuff to just sort through some things and found this old phone of mine and <laughs> then one thing led to another. I was deeply in a hole like nostalgic feel and found all this old stuff and of course I can't get rid of anything so yeah and I thought why not just share with you and um yeah use my old phone for it so please excuse me if there's any like bad sound or bad like video um I just wanted to quickly hop on here and make a small video <laughs> That's okay for you. Mm. Yeah. I don't know if you can relate, but whenever I try to sort through things, I end up finding old books and old, like, I don't know, makeup stuff. And I just end up sitting on the floor, like, trying out old pens. And oh, I don't know, it's a whole mess. But yeah, I just thought maybe you were interested in some of the things that. I used to own, or, yeah, I found this um, old box of mine, it has this cute little ribbon on here, I think I decorated it myself a few years back, we can open it, oh. it has like this little notebook in here, so cute, but I think I never wrote anything in it. No, it's completely blank, but I could use it. Oh, and it has some old Polaroid pictures, like from me. Oh, it's so cute. And some old stickers and just notes from some friends. And more pictures. I love things like that. I can, like, if there's a memory attached, I will keep it forever. You can be sure. And I also found, like, a body oil that I used to, like, use every day. And I think that, I think I thought that I forgot it. Yeah, a friend of mine actually made that for me. Um, she wanted to like include some special oils to keep me safe and yeah usually just rub it on my arms and here on my chest and i don't know i mean i don't know if it keeps me safe from anything but it makes my skin so soft and i really like myself some soft skin and I guess like this glowing <laughs> yeah so it's really good to have this back it's very nice and it's so it smells so good I wish that you could smell me right now <laughs> yeah mm. I found um some cute little necklaces that I used to wear like, do you like the one I'm wearing right now? I like it a lot, but I used to wear those colorful necklaces. I totally forgot about them. They look like this. They have those colorful pearls. I don't know. Maybe I should go back. <laughs> That's so nice. I have like a few more of these in this small thing. And I have a few... Like I made myself with like smiley face and hearts and stuff. I used to do that all the time with my friends. Oh, this one's pretty. Oh yeah, I remember. Oh, I made that one with my best friend. I had like different shades of pink. Oh, yeah, I really love pink. Maybe I should start wearing them again. Maybe? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> yeah? Oh, and I found this 
this book. I don't know if you know about that. It's called The Comfort Book by Matt Haig. He's like one of my favorite authors. Yeah. I don't know, I think about it a year ago. And oh, I'm just a really slow reader, but like as it says, it's like comfort book and it has those small stories in it. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if you're interested, but yeah. There's like this story right here. Tips for how to make a bad day better. Okay. That should be interesting. I haven't read that one yet either. Get up, get washed, get dressed, stand up, move your body, put your phone to another room, go for a walk, stretch, place your legs against the wall, get some sunlight if there's some available, head if you can to summer green, a garden, a park, a field, a meadow, a forest, breathe deeply and slowly and consciously for a little while. I think that's so pretty. I don't know, I really like those short stories. I think I should start reading it again. <laughs> I think so too. And I mean, it's not that big either. Like, I can read it. Or, like, I think it's more for when you're having a bad day to just, um, yeah, feel better, I guess. But yeah, what's really interesting, I found one of my old diaries. Are you writing a diary? You don't? I'm not really good at it either, but yeah. I have, I can even have some photos in here. I cannot show you, it's a bit too private, but yeah, let's see. I can go get back. Maybe there's something like that I can read to you that is not too private, so... Okay... Here... Oh, that was back in 2022. It's a bit sad, but <laughs> it was a while back. I am feeling a bit lonely sometimes, but it's getting better day by day and Today my mom came by and made me some lasagna. She's a person that I can trust a lot. I felt bad a few days back, so that's why she came over. Yeah. Sometimes I do feel a bit lonely. But it's nice to have some people that I can really depend on. It seems a bit sad, but I, I'm all better now, I think. Yeah, I think you should really start writing to a diary. It's really, it's really nice, I think. And it's nice to look back to if you're getting older and older, just reading those old diary entries. I mean, there are still a lot of pages left, so I think I should put that on my nightstand so I can maybe in the evening write a few lines yeah it would be good <laughs> yeah um what else is in here or on here i found this all colorful makeup palette that's how the beauty youtubers used to do it <laughs> it's so colorful I think I never really used it. It always looks brand new. But I always wanted to try like those more colorful like eye stuff things, but I never really got into it. Maybe I was a bit too scared of what other people might think. But yeah, which color do you think suits me? The pink one. I mean, I'm not wearing anything right now, but <laughs> I can put some on. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Ooh that's very bright. <laughs> I 
I don't know how good I can do it, like, without the mirror. Oh, now it looks like someone punched me in the face. <laughs> Maybe let's try it with the other eye. Oh no. <sighs> You're now live with me trying out bold makeup. <laughs> oh god, now I look so ridiculous. I think that there's a reason why I never tried this before. Maybe, like, with a complete look, like with the right clothing, that could be a look. <laughs> I don't know about it. <laughs> you have to let me know what you think. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, I think that's all that I wanted to show you. I hope this was okay. I hope this wasn't too, like, personal for me. But I think sometimes it's nice to just um, sit down with an old phone and try to record something. <laughs>